and border. The campaign is in honor of former General Secretary of the SACP, Joe Slovo. It's aimed at encouraging young people to make education a priority. Well, the Communist Party used the launch of this campaign to raise concern about the state of schools in rural areas. The party attributes poor performance at schools to poor infrastructure and a lack of resources. We've come to launch the Joe Slovo Right to Learn campaign, a yearly campaign where we focus on ed matters educational. So we've come to congratulate the matriculants of 2016. And we've also come to emphasize to all stakeholders in education that education is a permanent process. So even this year, as communists, we've come to say to all members of the community, we must make sure that schools are ready as a starting point, that there's equipment in schools, that uh, government makes sure that uh, pitches in schools, playgrounds, are ready for athletics. All municipalities want to insist that they prepare for the schools, that the principals have stationary and personnel to teach, that SGPs make sure that there are career exhibitions throughout the year, and that students apply on time for universities and that they also apply for bursaries in the Department of Education. Racism in Cape Town has been in the spotlight.